And hello guys, welcome to Driver San Francisco. This is a kind of go driving around town as a person kind of thing. Whee! And it's got loads of cool sun jumps like that. And uh, yeah, so it's kind of a bit of a weird game, but also a cool game at the same time. So you go around as this guy called, I have totally forgot his name, is what he's called. Uh, but now you go around as him in his coma version of him. Uh, this is the completed game because I have finished it ages ago and you just kind of carry on driving around his coma even though he's not in it anymore and you might have seen this physic already because I kind of show it, showed it off so basically because you're just in a coma you just fly out and maybe let's say I want to go to my garage and maybe get out of Bentley we just zoom in uh, zoom out, zoom in we say enter it, uh, vehicles uh, Bentley here's my Bentley and uh, doesn't stop as soon as you've uh, finished the game. It, you kind of can carry on getting points. You can carry on like trying to get all the cars in game, all that kind of stuff. Uh, so it's a pretty nice little thing. This is just a kind of little 20 minute. Well, it's uh, it's the same turn of times as all my other videos. But I'm just trying to like this is basically what a little look at which I might be doing. I keep forgetting that's not the break in this one because I've been playing too much GTA. So like, I'll probably be doing a couple of, of uh, little looks at during the week, probably in between the times where I'm doing Let's Plays. Uh, but yeah, this is literally just, you kind of can drive around, you can be a massive dick because where GTA has, you can hit people, this you can't. I shouldn't absolute clever person and you just go die 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 kind of sideways into them then you can kind of hit them but I believe there's better ports and everything so it's a pretty good game uh, there's multiple ports it has quite nice car physics actually if you can see I have totally wrecked my car right now uh, there's several different views you have the in-car driver view so you're like Dun -dun 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 -dun. I'm in my Bentley. I don't like this view because I'm rubbish at driving in it. Uh, you might see that it comes up with uh, music, but uh, I'm not listening to that. Or oh, and so on, you guys, because it is kind of. I think it's copyrighted, so I can't really post it on YouTube. But I, you, I'm literally just swerving. So basically, yeah, this is literally the whole game mechanics. It's, you saw that I hit a guy because I was swerving but like this is basically the whole game mechanics is you drive around like this you can turn around like maybe I'll go and nick a cop car there's, there's another problem and then no 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 you can see that they're above us not actually at the same level as us and uh, basically this a huge just game basically about how much devastation can you cause so you see I've parked that uh, bus up there with that cop car in it totally didn't mean to do that but I've done that now so what you do is you go <coughs> straight into the back of that cop car because of course you were just driving as them and uh, now you've got to lose the cops ah sugar ah. Uh oh uh oh uh oh come on drive 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 and then if you just do a nice little turn somewhere where you can get off a motorway please you can kind of just escape the cops a bit it's quite a nice little uh, game it's quite cheap on the xbox live stores i can't remember how much i go for but it was very cheap uh... and it's, it's just a little game that you can kind of go through you can kind of play it you can kind of have a little muck around in it like 
Because you don't even need to have completed the game to have the free roam. It, I believe free roam's open instantly, basically. So, like, you can kind of just, like, drive around however you want, kind of thing, straight away. Sorry about, uh, people showing up on the bottom of my screen. I will try to sort that out for next time. Oh. But, yeah. So, uh, this is basically the whole game mechanics. So, uh, yeah. So, um, sorry, I just had to sort something out on my computer. And, uh, so, basically, it's a little, uh, nice little game. I believe you could, instead of, like, going, oh no, I'm gonna die, you can kind of just go, uh, that looks like a nice place to go into. Travel over here a bit, and uh, just go into the main garage. Maybe get out a something a bit funner than a just a little car. Yeah, that should be a little bit of fun, just to drive around town in. You know, you can have a look at it. This will only probably be a ten-minute thing, actually, because you know there's not much else except for this. So yeah, you kind of just, you go around, oh, sugar, there is a boost bar, I've got it up a bit. So what you do is you press forward on your directional stick, as in your right stick, I believe it is. And you kind of just, sorry, left stick, rubbish on my left and right. And you can just drive around, full pelt, in a school bus, which is quite fun. Even if I do say it so myself, it's just a little fun thing that you can. I mm, people say it's a very good game. I'm just gonna tell you guys, it's a lot more of a kind of a game if you want to muck around a bit, like a more of a toy game. I got it thinking, oh, it'll be great. It wasn't best thing in the world, and. Uh, it's got quite a nice little, it's quite a nice little sandbox game, as in open world, you can go around in all these kind of different vehicles. You don't have to complete any of the story missions, I'd like to say. Might not be true to, uh, like, unlock all these cars and stuff. Like, you just have to do challenges that they have and everything to, like, unlock certain car makers and certain cars. That's all you've really got to do, but you can, like, buy quite a few cars from the start. And like the challenges are, I think they are like, they might be locked, I can't remember. But no, it's kind of the, it's a game for people that like, just you know, mucking around, doing a lot of funny stuff. So, uh, let's say, because I've just literally crashed that. Oh, we're going to a meeting, so either we try to kind of can pretend we're going to a meeting or we can just do donuts and then drive off very quickly in this direction because I've just seen what I really wanted to want no 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 <laughs> see it's very nice drift mechanics as well now you see that this has a broken car on the back and so what you can do is you can kind of swerve and you see how it's not meant to be a killing game yeah very much turns into a killing game once you have a car on the back of you because you can like I don't think the game really realizes it and you can just go I'm gonna go into my garage now <laughs> and like just leave that car causing havoc it's a very nice little system though very nice because basically uh, let me just yes I do if we go out again just in my DeLorean no, because that's kind of how cool I am. If we just go out quickly and we uh, fly on top of this car, I can't fly, Marshy. And there is a chief and everything for going 88 miles per hour. I've already got that though, so oh it. So. I can just cause havoc with this thing, like kill, 
well not kill, just like knock them out and and then literally just oh what a lunatic hitting people like that oh what a lunatic you see what I mean you can literally just go nah I'm not gonna be that guy I, it's quite a nice little thing you can kind of go no I am not that guy and uh it's a very nice little mechanic I quite like it a lot So you see, nice little revs, and then doesn't have as nice of a takeoff as um, the ones in GTA 5, but that's for another day. So this has been a look at Driver San Francisco. It's pretty cheap on the Xbox Live stores at the moment. Goodbye.